Nothing about our story has been what most would call normal. Starting from the way we met, a hesitant, reluctant right swipe on Tinder, her reluctancy, <laughs> a parking lot proposal, and now moving our wedding up by three months during a pandemic. As crazy as this may be to hear, I wouldn't change any of it. I want to take everyone back to December of 2016. Karina had been living in North Carolina for a few months by then, and she and Philip connected online. From the moment I saw you strutting across the parking lot on our first date, I had this feeling that something was special about you. And in that moment, everything made sense. I knew that cute boy sitting across the table eating pizza and drinking Red Oaks was going to change my life. What I didn't know at that moment was how you would help me grow as an individual and as a partner. Why did you do this? Let's just get married. Sweet Pea, you came into this world and you've instantly made it a better place. Welcome family and friends to Karina and Philip's wedding. This is a day almost four years in the making and Karina and Philip are thrilled to be surrounded by their family and friends as they take this next important step in their relationship. I vow to not only be your wife, but your biggest supporter, your best friend, and your hockey watching partner. I vow to continue to grow into the best man and partner I can possibly be. I vow to grow with you and navigate through new challenges with my hand in yours. I vow to love you during life's highs and equally, yet if not more, when things get tough. I vow to always make you brownies when you're sad, the good kind, not the box kind. <laughs> I vow to you that I will never go to sleep without telling you how much I love you. I don't know how I can love you any more than I do in this moment, but I vow to love you more and more every day that we're on this earth together. And last of all, I vow that I will be your partner, friend, and confidant until death do us part. I am truly honored to announce that you are husband and wife. I have here a receipt dated 1 7 2017. Felipe on Karina's first birthday in North Carolina. This was Karina's birthday weekend. He greeted me by opening my car door, giving me a huge hug and telling me how much he hated UNC, and the rest is history. Two Red Oaks, two late night cheese pizzas, and two pepperoni pizzas. As Philip and I are sitting at the bar, I am proud to share the moment. He looks at me and he says, Elias, I think she's it. I have kept this on my fridge for four years because I knew the day would come when I would save it and give it to them. I'm running when I hit the ground, that's what I'm all about. Now, do I even need to mention your million watt smile? Do you light up any room with your smile? She is one of the kindest, most selfless people I know. Sandy, Phil, and Ruth, they have done such a phenomenal job raising him. Felipe, I couldn't dream of a better guy to marry my 20. I remember how Karina looked at you and realized, damn, this is the one. There's no denying it. I have to accept you now. 
And in all honesty, Phil, you made this a lot easier on me. I'm very thankful that Karina brought you into our lives, and I look forward to many years of you being our permanent third wheel. <laughs> So welcome to the family, Philip. And like we said earlier, we're stuck with each other now. Karina, I love you more than words, and I'm thrilled that you decided to marry the guy from Raleigh who liked hockey and took you on the greatest first date ever. I can't wait to see the life that you build together and wish you both endless love, happiness, laughter, and good wine. Here's to beer, pizza, and true love. Cheers. I love you both from the bottom of my heart like you have no idea, and I wish you all the happiness that life has to offer. You both deserve the very best. I love you guys. still haven't figured it out and it's those beautiful brown eyes or that radiant smile of yours but you have this way of inspiring me to be the best version of myself. Today I am beyond giddy that I finally get to call you my husband. You are everything and more that I've always wanted but never thought existed. I'm all about it.